In Colombia, 10 military members and one civilian have been accused of murdering at least 120 people and forcibly disappearing two dozen others and falsely claiming their victims were guerrilla members who had been killed in combat. Tuesday's indictment marks the first time Colombia's Special Jurisdiction for Peace Tribunal charged military members involved in what's known as the false positive scandal, where thousands of extrajudicial killings were falsely portrayed as leftist rebels who died in combat. The false positives were meant to help give a sense of the Colombian military's victory in the half-century U.S.-backed conflict against the FARC. That's the Revolutionary Armed Forces of Colombia. This is Catalina Diaz, a judge with Colombia's Peace Tribunal. La sala ha encontrado que se trató de un patrón de macrocriminalidad, es decir, la repetición de por lo menos 120 asesinatos durante dos años en un mismo territorio por un mismo grupo de personas asociados en una organización criminal y siguiendo un mismo modus operandi. The tribunal was created after a peace deal was signed in Colombia in 2016. To see our interview with Mario Mario yesterday, you can go to democracynow.org.